Cervante. at all times to listen to my commands. Touch him up. Back to your corner, gentlemen. The bell round one. Davis, Diego Magdaleno, who he starched in 53 seconds. The American contingent. Yeah, uh, it, more vocal than we would have thought in this crowd. Not sure. Across the country. Yeah. A half left and Cruz with a is At least he, he came out and stayed true to his brand, ripping the fight in a long time. He hasn't had consecutive to see prodigious power. Oh, and Davis stumbling. The right movement is important for him. And you know, Davis, what he does is. Around. And a great start for Esau Cruz. Right two, but to find a way to knock you out. That punch could be foreshadowing for the future in this fight. Oh, my. Oh, and Cruz wow. just staggered. Davis with the down. It would be a slip. Uh, yeah, just a right hand that missed over the... Shorter. And referee rolling in a slip. Plenty of drop. He's not throwing much punches. Oh, that knocked uppercut again. There it is. Really accurate punching. Let his arm go. Let his arm go. Davis <laughs> able to evacuate. Jab, and there's Davis. Yeah. He wants to keep doing that because David, you know, he's really smart in finding openings. His power, 47 percent of his power punches, which is everything other than past the midpoint of the second. Upper cut to detonate so they can explode. And hands are free, guys. Let him go. And again, the the tight guard that Cruz has stop, right stop, now stop, stop. is. This whole building is waiting for one of those upper ground. Davis good. A version of those punches getting out of since he became a main event fighter. So this is a different experience. Ryan Cruz that got Davis's attention as Davis looks to counter. And against Barris was the tallest. Yes. And there Davis launches a left and Cruz along the ropes going to the body. This was one of those moments where look here, he cranks up that left mm. uppercut. It kind of bounces off. Uppercut finds a home to the body. Dina Cruz putting the pressure, closes the distance. The jabber. We didn't see many jabs. He 15 of the 17 landed. Davis avoids the sweeping left hook, although Cruz bounces that left punches. hook off Davis's body. And Davis going to the body with a... He's trying to do that against this rugged guy coming after him. Barry Hunter wanted the jab from him, and uh, Davis, he hasn't trying to make an effort. He is. He is, but you got to give it to Davis, too. Uh, you know, I... And Gervonta Tank Davis. Davis now, as Cruz doing what he did. This was a fight in which he could show the more of the nuances of his body. Oh, counter left hand bouncing off the nose of Cruz. Let's bring in Steve Farhood. Defensive movement using defense, lulling Cruz in the go of his punches. Uh, oh, there he landed yeah, that yeah. right oh, uppercut. He's got problems with that in recent fights. He's won the fight. Trying to land that right and then the left to the body of David. Yeah. time to run through there. This is not, uh, you know, it's bending the rules a little bit. Why, why not? <laughs> oh, and there's that left uppercut again. What does that mean, you believe? <laughs> a minute and a half left here in the fourth. And there again. Davis trying to get those uppercuts in, and here he winds up with one. And there, a very conscious effort by Cruz to block. You know the straight left. Another left. Yeah, the straight land and left. Yeah, there was a lot of bottom and punching from Leo. Oh, and the jab and the right up. Was, you know, Leo was backing uh, Davis. Thing. Hmm. Lead left hand scores for Davis. So far. Oh, oh. now a right stop, uppercut. Stop, stop, stop. Up and there's again the uppercut and the straight left by Davis. And that's great. He's got a, a lot of new tattoos. <laughs> great work. <laughs> and these two fat Times left here in the fifth. Lead right by Cruz. And then the left uppercut on the inside. And good defense. Head movement. Accuracy. Great. And then doing what we've seen his uh, promoter do a nice right. Right hand got in, but the left. Davis has been doing the angles, working angles really well, not giving Cruz a chance to let go of his hands. By Davis, and then the exit. Davis, and a right hand by 
Cruz. And a left. That's the shot. Well, Davis was right there. Yeah. Gave him the opportunity. Because, but yet not the right one. He has, you know, he, he's done a good job with that. Like so. Tank Davis and that left uppercut. Cruz walked into it. No punch, no punch. Straight left. Upstairs scores for Davis. And that up is 12 round affair. Right there. That's the uppercut. And again, it lands a little bit. Abner, your point is where he gets through. That's that short, short right, right hand that we talked about. He by a determined Isak Cruz and a couple of right uppercuts on the inside. He's credit for knowing that's a part of his game oh, plan. So is oh, big uppercut by Cruz. So while we talk about him as a power puncher, mm, four uh, rounds he's two on cue. 58 56. Oh, nice counter left hand. Oh, he's got a great right hook. And, and that the crowd one anticipates Javon the head of Cruz. Cruz using a little more head movement and trips. And the Matador. And he's almost free. The head movement of Cruz less now. Uh, some uppercuts are getting there, and this one got there. A very good one. Target left. Again, the uppercut by. Different, a variety of combinations of boxing skills. Anytime we see a surge in the offense of Gervasi. It's coming, and why not? It often does with Davis. 24. The icing on the kick for tonight will be just a knockout. Wrestling, a lot of grappling as we head to round. Final 30 seconds of the eighth. Cruz. He said, if you can do it, I can do it. He's had good moments in this round, and there he rips a uppercut or right to the body, then a nice uppercut. He reminded us and told us, guess what? I'm not just a big power puncher. I have boxes. Utilizing the range and all. Delivers that. Making him miss, making him pay. Lead left scores for Davis. And Cruz going to the body again, showing his hand speed. But it's Davis. Oh, nice a warning. But a lot of the punches are legal to the body, too, that he's strong. There's crafty combination. Mm. Counter right hook lands. People don't always associate with him, but he can punch very well in combination. The uppercut. And Davis in, in that last round, you know, we talk about the variety of punches. There started out the round pretty well. And it's amazing how he's in certain spots where he's to jab his way. Oh, oh my! Wow! Got wow, wow. body and a flurry. That left took by Cruz though was the oh, best punch he's, he's landed. A power puncher like Davis, when you see a tenth round, you think, oh maybe it's a boring fight. Oh, maybe he's not fighting well. Oh, rounds are straight ahead mm. as Cruz goes back to the body. It's a pretty good round. There he, you know, he, he's. Working the body, and here comes that left hook. That was a good left hook he landed. In that round, uh, did some great work with the right hook. He just... There's that lead right up. Cruz's patience is starting to pay off. Yeah. To defeat Gervonta Tank Davis. Crowd chanting Cici Pueda in the 11th. Yes, you can do it for Isak Cruz. A terrific final three minutes. Who wants it more? Is it the left hand of Davis in the jab right now? So is it the left, which of course is vital for him, and he landed so many early in the really close fight. Mm. Full-throated crowd at Staples Center. And to Subner. Yeah, you got to give it to Cruz because however Davis uh, broke or, or his hand, Cruz took a lot of shots with that hand. Yeah, yeah but I got to say, <laughs> it's of Davis just wanting to continue. Wow, that sweet looking lead right uppercut by Davis. Being used as expected, a lead right hook. I'm torn to think this is right close. Good right hook again by Davis. But Davis is uncomfortable. He's been wincing. Yeah. Now utilizing his footwork, and he's become a one-handed fighter. Good job with just the right. Oh, very oh, good yes. job, both with the jab and using that right hook. And and Cruz, this is... Javante Tank Davis. Oh, wow. He's got to be careful. More. A minute left. It is delivering dividends. The jab and Cruz on it to take advantage. And of the Davis has done a very 
good job of boxing here in this round, and we assume that left tank rolled into Tinseltown, hoping to produce another electrifying episode of his KO show. But man, the extent of the injury, but there's no doubt about it. Yeah. Davis has not used the round. The not getting himself caught against the rope, using the only the right hand, uh, you know. His mentor, Floyd Mayweather Jr. Happy, although Staples Center enjoying what they've seen. And still the undefeated.